Riding a blue barong Tagalog with his hair tied back, the Prince of Liechtenstein was hip and cool when he arrived for his launch of the, his new project. Prince Alfred has chosen the Philippines as the venue where he can build the ASEAN Bridge of Peace. Rock band River Maya performed for an unlikely crowd. Foreign dignitaries, members of the Academe, a former president, and the night's guest of honor, Prince Alfred of Liechtenstein. The prince is in the country to launch his project, which promotes cultural understanding and world peace. The idea is to create some international dialogue and to create a platform uh, to foster a culture of peace, a culture of love, and a culture of reverence for life. The project has tied up with schools such as the Asian Institute of Management, the Ateneo, and the University of the Philippines. It will bring Nobel laureates for economics, peace, physics, chemistry, and medicine to various parts of the Philippines to talk about the overall theme of a culture of peace and development in a globalized world. I'm very happy because uh, we feel that potentially we are we are entering into some major conflicts maybe in this region and so it's uh, better to work in due time to prevent conflicts and to resolve existing conflicts the ponytailed prince believes the issue of peace shouldn't be limited to politicians and the academe which is why his group invited one of the country's most popular rock bands to get involved in the project well, i like pop music and i like I like all kinds of modern music, uh, so I'm, I'm sure they have something to tell us. Maybe we see more of the bad side, but there's really more good in the world and people just don't talk about it as much. Peace happens every day in, in little ways that we probably overlook. Um, so if we can get all our, uh, all our acts together, so to speak, we can probably experience it in a bigger way. For most sleeping couples, snoring is a main source of unhappiness.